thank you all for uh, coming here. Um, Laura, if you're listening, it doesn't matter what's happened. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what type of trouble. There's nothing we can't fix together. Myself and your family. There's so many people, so many people that miss you. There's so many people that were out. We haven't slept. We haven't eaten. We're just looking and we're praying that you're safe. And I'm asking to just let us know that you're safe. If somebody has her, please understand that you've taken away a huge, a huge person in so many people's lives. Friends and family and students that she has. I know what she means to me. I know what she means to everybody else. And we just want to know if she's okay. We just want her back. She was uh, super excited for the uh, start of the school year. I know uh, she had talked to some her principal and her teachers, like her coworkers, about uh, um, her being pregnant and how excited she was. And uh, it's just a complete shock that I mean, I think leading up to leading up to the weekend that she's missing, I mean, I don't I don't believe anybody has any uh, inclination to think that something was wrong or just... I'm sorry any of your last conversations with her I, I don't know where she is that's all I don't know like I don't I know we're all trying to do everything we can to find her and I just pray that I pray that she's safe and she comes back. That's all I care about right now. Laura and I have known each other probably for 10 years now. Um, we've, you know, any normal relationship just take one step at a time and you take the progress that comes with you and been to doctor's meetings we've been to sonograms and all the prenatal care that you know you could ask and I'm sorry <laughs>